We are at the charts. Uh, so our positions, we're still in our one position of dots. Uh, that's 100% my fault because yesterday I was too busy uh, minting NFTs and stuff that I did not get us into earlier time frame shorts. And it really didn't, the setups weren't like great yesterday. Because if you see like Bitcoin here, for example, yesterday we had a, a little pump, like, right? Everyone... Not everyone, but um, there were some bears or bulls out there that were pretty, pretty stoked. They said, this is it. This is this is the bottom. I'm not too convinced about that. Um, I mean, here in the daily, we still have an overbought signal here. And so, like, we took profits um, uh, on, on this uh, vector red candle, right? We, we took our short profits there. Um, and so, didn't... I don't know. You know, I, I could. I think today could be a good day to actually start entering um, some shorts. It's not looking, yeah, like right here, one hour, looking pretty brutal, looking pretty brutal. Uh, four hour, not looking hot. I mean, we have a, an oversold signal, right? We have upward momentum, but RSI is pointing down on Bitcoin. So it's not looking, it's it's looking like lower prices for Bitcoin right now. And I would think that it could be a good time. So after the show here, I'll set up some alerts and see if we get in some some shorts today. Um, yes. Yeah. Um, the other, okay, so ETH, let's take a look at ETH. All right, so here, four hour, we're looking, look at this giant red candle. This is definitely, I mean, we could definitely see some, some lower lows maybe down here um, around this area is where we could see a bounce. But, um, you know, we're getting lower highs and lower lows. So, um, I mean, I, I'm expecting, uh, you know, could come down here and take out this vector candle zone. Um, I'm expecting some lower lows here on the four-hour charts for ETH. Um, let's take a look on the daily. Yeah, see, it's pulled away pretty far from the 50 uh, EMA here. And, uh, uh, yeah, I mean, we could we could see it extend even further. Um, but no, like, vector candle zones on the daily. So maybe you really just kind of wicks down um, to, to around this level and then picks up, returning back up to the 50 EMA and um, getting these vector candles up here. So... You know, a good entry for a long, I'd be looking at uh, towards the bottom of this, uh, maybe, maybe today, uh, could be a good one to, to long at these levels. I want to check out the one hour and see if we can see a nice oh, potential long. All right. Yeah. Yeah, right. Look at this nice wick. It'd be great if we could get put in some some long orders around here around that price there as we bounce and come back up and take these take these vector candle zones i mean we could take this too um but we'll see we'll see what happens here with, with the, how, how big this dump is we won't know really until later today tomorrow on how how big how big this dump actually is um all right so that's eth let's take a look at Ape, let's do some Ape Watch. See, Ape, okay, so Ape is interesting because Saturday is right when uh, Yuga Lab's doing their um, yes. land sale. Yes, we have the land sale coming up, and it's going to be uh, rumor gonna cost has 600 it. ETH, right? 600 or ape. ape, sorry, ape. 600 Ape. 600, 600 ape. ape. 600 Ape. ape. To so, buy a plot there. Yeah, guys, so, I'm... I'm I'm looking at this and it's just like I, until Saturday and right. And I think everything that they're going to be, they're just taking that ape and they're just locking it away. So yeah, yep. it's going to be a, it, yeah, at least for a year or something, at least. Something yeah. Like that. Yeah. Yeah. This could be nuts. Um, so really, yeah. if you're unless you have 600 ape to buy uh other side land the best way to probably get in on this is to have ape but to buy at this price now 
is i mean it's you're buying at, a, at, a, at an all-time high right now and well uh, and i think it's just going to be because want, but a lot of people are because so, room it, there is rumors to i don't know that that it's not you could maybe buy an eth too i don't know about that though but yeah, um, I don't know. but, but I, it makes I, sense I would have for them to i would want to be an og ape coin holder right now <laughs> oh for sure yeah <laughs> that's um, what i want to be yeah so it is uh ape is going ape man there yeah, is no I wouldn't, I wouldn't buy stopping right this yeah. one um yeah you are you are at you are at the top i mean it even would be interesting yeah. to see what happens right on saturday because what could happen is a lot of people take you know their their positions from like ethereum or something uh maybe they got a bunch of bnb they're gonna go put it in ape so then they could go participate in land sale right um that's what i could see happening so ape could actually start pumping like crazy over the weekend um but then as it then i could just see it just crashing just as fast you know what i mean oh of course yeah it's because it's like once, once everyone, type stuff. yeah once once you once you get your ape to try to mm -hmm. go mint and then it's like oh crap i didn't i didn't get it so i'm just gonna go get it on secondary market you sell your ape you know it's just like it's it's going to be really yeah. interesting. Alternatively, uh, ApeCoin could go absolutely crazy. It's just, it's, uh, yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, it's hard yeah. to know. It's a nail biter. It, uh, I think it'll be just fun to watch. It'll be interesting to see come Monday what the price of ApeCoin is. Yeah, um, maybe because we're um, going to be, we're going to be on the other side. Well, let's so. see. Maybe, maybe there's a good buying opportunity for Ape here, actually. So if we get a oh, nice boy. overbought symbol. Well, I might put an order in to see, you know, next yeah. week we could see what happens. As an experiment. Have some skin okay. in the game, you know what okay. I mean? May, yes, add watching. some excitement. I like I yeah. like what you're saying. Yeah. Just um, throw ourselves into the fire. <laughs> shit, yeah, yeah. For the for the lols. For the lols. <laughs> We're buying the top, baby. We're <laughs> selling the bottom. Oh. Uh, yeah, no. So, like, right here on the one hour, we could be getting it over... Uh, an overbought signal here so we can get a, a red dot so once that i'm not expecting any like pullback necessarily but maybe a little bit of pullback uh cools down for a little bit um see so yeah, how we're getting one here too um and then just try to get the best price possible you know the best entry we can right now because it just is it's gonna it just looks like it's it's number go up until um end of saturday is what what it looks like yeah. Um yeah, we'll see. Maybe we'll ape in ape in the ape today. Um, um Dekenza's asked, did we start the NFT ETH challenge? Uh I, I not yet. Does do you mean a challenge of uh how much NFTs we can uh, or an ETH we can accumulate using NFTs? Is that what we're thinking? So or? we could up do an update on our position since we yeah. were, so ever since ever since I got this school because the whole thing, right? It was like what got me was the fucking right, Dickens, and it is semi your fault too. You you kind of got me oh, into all this oh. again. Because I wasn't into <laughs> minting. I wasn't like, I'm not an NFT minter. Yeah, we weren't. We we hadn't been minting for and for then and then I'm like, oh, you know, I love these skulls, these toxic skulls. I'm gonna get it as a tattoo. I'm gonna mint it. I mint it. I and flip now it. I mean, you like you become a half. degen again. And now I'm like, okay, got the bug. Now I'm all like, yeah, let's mint, mint and flip, mint and flip. Yeah. So we're gonna, but, we're gonna, well, we have a, we're, we're gonna have a vault wallet, a GM wall, uh, vault wallet. This is all, this, you're getting the, you're getting, you're early right now on the news, but we're gonna create a, a vault wallet where we're gonna have, uh, yeah. all, all our activity of our of kind of the GM show uh, NFT portfolio. So we'll go into that there, next. So we Let's, will do. Should we just move on to NFTs? Do we have anything else? <laughs> That's like, does anyone really care about my charts? It's does anyone it's, really yeah, like my drawings? Look at it. It's red. Does anyone it's actually red. like my doodles? It's going down to zero today. Move on. You know, next tomorrow will be a different day. <laughs> Matt, we need the uh, Matt. It was up yesterday. The, uh, it's down today. Tomorrow it'll be up. Next, you make yeah. NFTs out of Matt's squiggle drawings. Your daily squiggle chart drawings. Just screenshot it, mint it on some uh, shit. No, uh, okay. Yeah. Well, I mean, uh, what, well, do you have any other updates for us? I mean, uh, you know, don't let us pressure you out of this. Don't let Dekenso run the show, man. 
He's not the producer of the show. Dude, I'm, I'm more into the NFTs than I am with these charts right now. So I'm like, I'm, but uh, yeah, NFT, Matt has slipped, has slipped back into degendom. I mean, I, I can yeah, vouch. He, I he's, he drove a long distance to just mint uh, in the past 24 hours. A and long it, distance. What's a long, long far distance? enough? Far enough. What? Like a yeah. 10, 15 minute drive is long. Far distance. Enough. No mm -hmm. way. <laughs> he didn't um, even say come on we were thrown completely off to kansas this is all your fault bnb he, here is doing uh a, a, a bart simpson pattern here right it's like the bart simpson head i don't know there's his nose and there's his mouth that's bart right something like that <laughs> That's something like bart but yeah so uh because i was okay so i was looking at bnb because i'm thinking about Getting some BNB to go ahead and mint this uh, the the lunar crystals. Maybe I do that. Um, Interesting. But uh, but anyway, so the chart here looks pretty brutal right now for BNB. I mean, and we have here this giant green vector candle on the twenty four minute. So I could right, we could totally see the price coming down and reclaiming uh, this green vector candle zone. The kimono wave. Right, our awesome indicator, awesome okay, trading indicator. It. There you go. He there you go. It. Said it. Uh, is definitely looking like hey, we should be hey. See here, the one hour it keeps saying it wants to, but look at this candle here on the one hour. This is saying this is saying that hey, we want to change this. This we're done with this dump. Is what this is. This is a, a hammer here that's forming. Um, so I'll be interested to see in the next hour what this what this candle looks like. Oh, see, it's starting to come down. So this could really this could just fulfill this wick here, and we could see some lower prices. It doesn't because right because this is the one hour, the twenty four minute looks bad. Yeah, it's it's we're gonna see some lower prices, guys, on BNB for sure. Um, the daily. Eh. It's still still in negative territory, so I could totally see uh, prices coming down here. Um, you don't like to see this candle necessarily. Well, I guess it's fine. It you know I, I just you, it's not like a clear test of the fifty EMA, right? I would like to see the price like really really challenge it, but that could a lot of times be the bounce from the fifty EMA. Um, and we could see that, you know, some lower, some lower lows here. Um, so yeah, I mean, come on. So yeah, lower prices all around. It looks like, although BNB is one of the only ones that is up right now. Um, but for how long is the question? Is it up for, uh, let's check out some Luna here. Luna has been stuck in this range like crazy for for a while. Um, it's not moving, man. It is just pinging off of the 50 EMA here. So, I mean, it, it, the daily looks like we might want to see a retrace. We have this giant green vector candle here. I see more reasons, like more signs right now just on the daily chart that says price will, go, will want to come down. Um, here on the four hour, we could be right. VWAP is starting to point down. We could be exhausting this pump and we could be seeing some lower prices here. Um, all right. I want to check on our, our, the one that we have or one little position we have is the dot. Okay. Oh, what's this is what's our, we have a little dot, dot position. We have a little dot, dot position. Dot. Um, and it's a short, right? Yeah, we're short and dot. Um, and, you know, as soon as, because we basically short, I think we, we bought in right here. So, so yeah, so we been, we were down all day yesterday, but it looks like, hey. Good, keep be, coming this, down. Yeah, this short yeah. can be paying off for us here. Um, what am I looking at? The daily, give me some more room here. Oof. See, Dot doesn't Oof. really move that much, man. Really doesn't move that much. Nothing like like some of the other ones we were just looking at. Um, where are we on the four hour here? 
Big range happening here. Yeah, it just looks like it's ready for the next leg down. It's like, let's just let's yeah. go to the next leg. Yeah, lower highs, lower lows. Let's get another lower low. And then we'll take profits. Yeah. Boom. Yeah. Take profits. So, Always. Looking, looking, looking like a good day to short so far. Looking like oh, a good day. Okay. Okay. 